Welcome to another episode of Talk Shit TV. I'm your host, Fat Cat. And I'm here tonight to talk to you about yet another issue that's been on my mind. And, you know, every now and then I do a segment and it's regarding like, you know, all the videos may be targeted towards one thing or targeted towards another. So this time it's sort of going to be like a real mix up and like a mukalaka tukalaka. We're going to mix it up. And tonight's Talk Shit TV is about periods. And are we fucking on the period? I know there's a lot of people out there that do it, but a lot of people don't want to say it. But I know y'all doing that shit. Because I know. So, talking to some people that I know and getting some opinions about some different things, and I find out that more people than I thought actually like the quote-unquote red stripe <laughs> I guess that's what they're calling it these days the red stripe but apparently it's not really a big deal to have sex on your menstrual and apparently there's a certain way that you have to do it well after listening and, and getting some different opinions and some advice about some things also I just decided that I probably should put it out there and say it. I seen uh, a status to this effect um, a, a while back and I thought that I may need to elaborate on it. But I know some people would say that is nasty and disgusting and maybe even forbidden and taboo. But I think that it's something that we should discuss that we should talk about are people really having sex on their period and if so is it a fetish is it something that one could learn to enjoy are we trying to say don't knock it till you try it is this what's happening i'm not sure and i don't know if it's going to be quite right for me however um it may be good for some people so, like I said, don't knock it till you try it. And a famous saying that I heard come out of this situation is, if you can walk through mud, then you can fuck through blood. Talk shit.